Biochemistry is one of the scariest subjects in the biomedical section. It used to be my weakest subject as well until Dr. Sahar made it so simple that I answered every single biochem question correctly in my exam. Today, I have invited Dr. Sahar to share some smart exam-focused biochem tips. Hi, Dr. Sahar. Thank you so much for joining us today. Hi, Anshu. Thanks so much for inviting me. And yes, biochemistry was actually one of my favorite subjects in biomed. Are you serious, Dr. Sahar? Yes, uh, biochem is actually very easy when you know what the exam asks. I agree. Your tips helped me so much during my IDAT exam as well. Can you share them with students preparing for next year exam? Absolutely. Biochemistry has five main sections you must focus on. It has enzymes, metabolic pathways, carbohydrates, amino acids, and the lipids. That's perfect. Now let's break them down one by one. What should students study in enzymes? Know your coenzymes like magnesium for hexokinase or zinc for carbonic anhydrase. You should also know the induced fit model, Michaelis-Minton equation, Gibbs free energy change. What are different factors affecting the enzyme activity or the rate of reaction like pH, temperature, and the three types of inhibition: competitive, non-competitive, and the uncompetitive one. Yes, I even got a question based on allosteric regulations. What uh, what about carbohydrates? I know the alpha one four, alpha one six glycosidic bonds in the starch and glycogen. Know what the limit extremes are. Uh, study about the storage disorders like Van der Kolen, McArdle's, Hunter syndrome. That's great. And the protein amino acid section. Then essential and the non-essential amino acid. Know about the amino acid metabolism disorder like PKU, albanism, uh, alkaptan urea. The steps in collagen synthesis that you also got in your exam. A difference between hemoglobin and myoglobin and the conditions like thalassemia, sickle cell anemia that are associated. Amazing. Now, what should they study in lipids? In the lipids, know about the PUFAs, polyunsaturated fatty acid, choline, uh, role of cholesterol, arachidonic acid pathway, uh, prostaglandins, inflammatory mediators, uh, synthesis of and function of bile salts. Mm -hmm. Perfect. Now, now let's discuss about metabolic pathways. For every metabolic pathway, whether it is glycolysis, Krebs cycle, urea cycle, glycogenases, the most important thing is to know the rate limiting steps and the rate limiting enzymes. For example, for hexokinase or PFK one, we know it's for glycolysis. Then we have G6PD for HMP shunt, acetyl CoA carboxylase for fatty acid synthesis. Then we have electron transport chain. All the complexes you should know. For example, cyanide poisoning or about the oxidative deamination, transamination. Wonderful. Now the last one, which is vitamins. Vitamins uh, know about the deficiencies, uh, diseases that can be associated with, and their clinical signs. Know about rickets, uh, beriberi, vitamin K deficiency, plagra, and megaloblastic anemia. Thank you so much, Doctor Sahar. Biochem finally feels simple to us now. It is simple when you study smart, actually. Thank you so much, everyone, for watching this, and follow Dentapest for more exam-focused tips. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank.